Hello, I'm Dr. Nigel Kendall, uh, lecturer in nutrition from the uh, Vet School at Nottingham. Um, I'm here today to talk about actually uh, trace element sample numbers or sample numbers in sheep to get a um, sensible story that we're not wasting money on sampling too few sheep that we don't give the whole story of the farm or too many sheep that we're just spending money that we don't really need. We took 360 uh, blood samples, uh, analysed those through various um, statistical processes, but one of the big things we noticed was you know, there were so many differences between each management group, whether that's a field or a mob of sheep moving around between fields and uh, going through that. So we didn't notice that with the farms we were working on. Um, with those farms and those management groups, it sort of came through that we needed to get a very good picture. To get a good picture of the, the trace element status of the farm, we needed to include the majority of the management groups. And we did some work with the samples, put through statistics, and to get a diagnostic picture, we needed really to get about four, four samples per management group. Now, if we're talking about fields and mobs, and especially uh, this time of year now, we'll be talking about having ewes and lambs together. Well, now, now just before we wean them. Uh, so you would be, if you were doing it with ewes and lambs together, you would actually treat them as separate management groups because your lambs may well be different in their trace element or other metabolite profiles to the ewes. Uh, certainly if you've got creep feeding which your lambs have got access to and your ewes haven't. Um, so we, you know, we found that sort of for a diagnostic on farm type sampling situation, four sheep per group were very good, okay, but we do need to look at most of the groups on the farm. If we wanted to go further and we're doing experimental stuff, then you might need to put more sheep per group so we can get up the magical p-values that we tend to talk about in the science.